top plays. I know. We were speechless. <laughs> we're ready to Excited. go. So we had a lot of good games on LSN this year as part of our uh, CEA Game of the Week schedule. And there were some outstanding highlights. So let's count them down from 10. Yeah, we're going to have Davey uh, really Way dissect in. See what these guys are working with. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Davey's back. <laughs> Luke Frommert has come on as of late for Towson. The alley-oop against Hopkins, one of the first games of the year on our air. I love that, just getting to the back pipe. One touch in. Ooh, quick stick. A little quick stick action. Towson won that game 17-8. to eight. Like Dave was saying earlier in the show, that's when they really went on that run. When they were going, yep. But number nine. Reed Bowering. He can score some goals. He can score some goals. And hey, Davey, oh, yeah. the I've dive, that's against Albany earlier in the year. Uh, Drexel lost, but that's pretty. Has the dive being back made just college game oh, I enormously love it. better? I love yeah. it. He's probably done that a couple times playing juniors, too, growing up. Yep. From Coquitlam. Yep. All right, let's go to number eight. Gabriel Proct. Prosick. Prosick, I'm sorry. BTB against Delaware. That was pretty. Just that's pretty good. Yeah, right? that's pretty good. That's uh, that's from some distance too. All your momentum going one way, just getting it on that far side corner. It's this, pretty good. This is the play on our Instagram on LSN. Casey Powell said it was nice. So then you know. Uh, it is. Then you know. Yeah, that's you know. I mean. <laughs> that's the king of BTBs himself. <laughs> right. It was approved. Casey Powell approved. Number seven, Colin Mailman. This is just a montage of him shaking and baking and making everybody lose their lunch money. Come on, you got to work in a. A mailman, I was waiting for a, a, a deliver, <laughs> posted. Come, come on, that's how this guy works. God, the mailman, he's delivering. Delivering some nice shots on the run here. He does have a nice square there to his defender, nice first step. Really can get that ball off him anywhere, coming from the hip. You're just born with the shake, right? That's nice. Now, this is when you want to get the food stuff in, because now it's Charlie Kitchen. Mm, shake and bake. There, there you go. Over Ooh. the head with the defense draped all over him. A flag came in Throwing on him. the kitchen sink at him. And there's the celly. Yeah. Big celebration guy. That's the way to be physical, though, taking a hit, just keeping those arms extended. He did this all year, folks. Delaware playing with some fire, some speed. He had, he had two poles on him right there. He's a junior. He's got another year. Speaking of young guys for Delaware, Ty Kurtz. He does this better than anybody. That is sweet. Is that is that is that the box game right there? Is that a, it is. And what's awesome about it? that is everyone every day in practice has probably seen that a ton, and then they stay after and they work it on themselves, and all of a sudden your skill as a team is just gone through the roof. Yeah, his, that's what's happening at Delaware. His low release is so deadly, and just a different <laughs> angle for that goalie to see, right? Hundred percent. And too, so many guys aren't even thinking to pull that out and, and play that way. <laughs> right. <But. laughs> that's crazy. That's seeing a couple seconds ahead. That's good stuff. All right, number four, Ryan Tears. This was a couple weeks ago. This had we were all watching this in the newsroom and, and going nuts because this is incredible. Just it, it, it's hard on the first view to really see it, but I mean it, it's crazy. That's filthy. That's that's a little. That's almost that's like Ryan Brown esque Ooh. with emotion, but just that's the level of difficulty nope. off the charts. That's there. a good. That's a good analogy. That was Ryan Brown in Israel all summer. Right, playing on that left side. I don't know if he had that extreme low angle. That's pretty. Yeah. That's pretty impressive. With all your momentum, full speed going below <laughs> <Right>. GLE, <laughs> you got to curve that one in there. In a negative angle. <laughs> all right, number three, Dylan Beckwith of Fairfield. This was Fairfield's moment of the year right here. This game, this night, it was cool. Against Utah. So he gets the hit. Yep. Fix it up. Gonna take the other direction. It just goes all the way to the hole. That's something. One-handed, one mind you. That's like the move when you make the crossover in basketball and you break someone's ankles. You, you gotta make the you, shot. You gotta, you gotta I mean, that it. hit means oh. more now that he went in and scored. Right, that's just a hit, you know, if he doesn't score. Part of the game. One-handed goal. You see, one and a goal, sweet. Yeah, that's pretty good. What too. was going on with Will Manny's defense? Uh, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, a lot of Will Manny <laughs> talk on this well, show Well, he mentioned Will was tuning in, and that's, that's Will's team, Utah. Marcus Holman, I'll come tell you on, that, that's, guys. Uh, that's some pretty good body control there to hold I'm off teasing. and allow the goalie to, uh, to to take that fake and finish that one-handed. That's pretty impressive. Coaches, though, are going to love that ride back. That's good stuff. Chris Connolly. This was, uh, this was last weekend. He first makes the hit. And then scores the backhanded goal with the dive on top of it. This got a lot of uh, pub. This was on the Sports Center plays, top 10 plays a few times. And for a good reason, because boom, another hit. Love seeing all these hits. Today. I love that. That's just a uh, blue collar UMass toughness play. 
You know, not, not being afraid to little contact, both on the pick and turn in the corner, backhanded, going to go hard. We'll let him know about it as well. We're going to be calling his name a few times, I think, tonight. I think you're right. All right, and finally, number one, Tyler Canto between the pipes for Towson. This is against Loyola. Davey was on the call for this. That's right. Wow. <laughs> You Travis remember? and I were, were very yep. impressed, I remember. <laughs> <laughs> and that this, oh. too, you know, this was in a, in a moment when Loyola was trying to gain a little bit of momentum, and that's that's just a huge save to gain that momentum right back. Tyler's played really well all season long, to that, be honest. That was another uh, one of the memorable moments, I think, but that, that win over Loyola, number one. For that, sure. That, that, that Wednesday night, it was something like that. It was. Um, one of the cool moments from this season. Caught him on a Tuesday night and really yep. catapulted that number one seed. And we're reminded if Towson does get to the championship and lose to UMass or uh, Drexel, you have those wins in your back pocket right. against Hopkins For and sure. Loyola uh, should things not go well. Final